Yo, what's up, everyone? <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, just feel like making this video. You know, 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 you you know, because um, I feel this is an interesting opportunity because with all these new updates and plants to PVZ2 lately, I thought it would be interesting to just play around with them with zone, you know, see where it goes. Not only that, I have a lot more freedom because I don't have to lose and just lose everything if I make a mistake. I have a lot more freedom because if I want to, I could just press retire here. And doesn't save the progress, and it's kind of like a sandbox, like I said in one of my older videos, but just felt like flying, you know, just felt like flying, using some of the newer plants that I have, so, also I apologize to you here, like, I don't know why, I'm, why am I using blow rest, not useful against the chickens, but, oh, look at that, look at that, it's all going downhill, yeah, just heck, I just gotta do that. Oh well. Oh well. I can just press retire and I can just do, do that again. It's absolutely wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful feature. Thank you, PopCap. One of the much better decisions you've added as of late. I don't know if I need blow. Also, once again, I apologize if you hear air conditioning in the background. I just. I wanted to make a video despite that, you know. I want to make you work. I want to make you work, Electric Peel. I want to see if I can make you possibly work. I really think if I use Homing Thistle combined with Electric Peel somehow, I can make it happen. Just need to work around these other tough zombies and see if I can make something happen. Puff Shroom, that's probably going to help against the football zombies immensely. Just want to make this work. I think if I make this work, that's where I'm going to call the video. Or unless it just goes on for too long and I can't do it. Let's hope I can do it though. I really want to make this happen. So, something you could do is just use the puff rooms to stall the zombies for a little. It's free. And it buys time to make more sun and build up your defenses. Then there's Sundew Tangler, which does cost money, but it also stalls the zombies a little. So, like, if you can get that to work, then that's great. Just gonna plant them. Oh, and the weasels are coming in. That's not fun. Plant food. Does that do anything? No. Oh, man. Oh, my God. That's frustrating. Very, very frustrating. Ugh. Got to take a little swig of water. Yo, we got the gargs coming in. Gonna use winter melon. See how that works out. Now, what's really cool about Sundew Tangler is that it can sort of stall zombies, which is really nice because, like, when zombies get entangled in them, uh, it stops the zombies that are behind them. Like, they sort of, like get stalled by, which is a very nice addition. Maybe Sundew Tangler isn't the best plant in the world, but it definitely has its uses, and I think here it has its potential. Oh, the octopus zombies. Come on, man. I don't need that. Oh, that's a whole load of baloney right there. Oh, and you are coming through. Ah, do something. Wow, that didn't even put a dent in it. Oh, my. This is not fun, guys. I'm sorry. This is actually, like, a drag at this point. Maybe I'll move on to Ancient Egypt Entanglement and see if that's better. But I really want to see if I can make some headway here. I want to try to make Electric Peel work somehow. I really do. Maybe Daisy Chain? I've had some luck with that before by itself. Maybe that can work somehow. 
I'll bring Gold Bloom for the extra sun and see what happens. Also, sorry if I sound nasally as well. Uh, it's just a Walmart. I work at Walmart and there's a lot of pathogens that flow through the air and honestly it gets my allergies and makes me all nasally because I just saw the junk that I touch there. It, it just gets into your body, you know? You can't really do much about it, but at least, I, you know, I don't, I don't know, man. <laughs> at least I'm getting paid for it, even if it's, you know, affecting my health in a little way. Uh, honestly, the money is worth it. The money's just worth it. <laughs> Plus, my immune system is pretty good. So, it works out. And even if my immune system does falter, guess what? It gives me days off. <laughs> Make lemons out of le lemonade, I guess. And... Oh boy. This is still not going well. I don't know why. It's just... Frust very incredibly frustrating. Oh, this... God dang it, man. Maybe I need to bring some insta-kills. Dang it. That is very frustrating. Very, very frustrating. Highway to the danger room is no joke, guys. Do I have any insta-kills? Do I have chili? No, I don't have chili pepper. Dang it. I do have primal potato mine. I'll see if I can make that happen, perhaps. I'll see what I can do. Guys, I have a good feeling about this one. I have a fe good feeling about this attempt. Maybe instead of two rows of sun shrooms, I'll do one row so I have more space for the daisy chains. Yeah, sunny sun sun. Fun in the sun, maybe. Summertime, summertime, fun times. I remember there was this one song about summer fun time babes or whatever in the regular show. You know, there's a few cartoons I've been meaning to watch, and that's one of them. I'm thinking between regular show, Chowder, and Courage. But money's tight right now, so I don't know which one to buy. Because I kind of plan on buying them on YouTube if possible. I don't know if that's a waste of money or not, but I say if one show is really special, then it's worth it. But honestly, if you guys happen to hear this right now, try to at least give a suggestion if you've seen any of the shows. Because I really do want to watch some of them. Okay, screw you, car, for speeding through the neighborhood at who knows what time. That's frustrating, and the, the primal potato ones are doing a really good job. This one, even if I don't win, it's doing a lot better, so that's, that's good. Oh, God, the boombox zombies. They're the worst, man. God, they're not fun to deal with. They're very, very frustrating. Oh, that is just... Primal potato mine? What? It's affecting the primal potato mine? I thought it couldn't affect ground plants. What? No way! No way! At least I have that one lawnmower. Dang it, man. That sucks. That actually sucks balls. I didn't mean to put that there. Mm, it's frustrating. That actually really is a bummer, bro. Major bummer, dude. Ugh, that sucks. That actually really sucks, man. Sucks. Oh man, this is falling apart already. What a bummer. Highway to the danger room, man. It's really no joke. Really no joke at all. The primal potato mines are helping though for sure. 
Like, which cartoon do you think is, like, the most worth it to watch between Chowder, regular show, and Courage? Honestly, I'm definitely leaning more towards Chowder. That's the one that I'm kind of thinking of because my friend also really likes it. It just seems very out of context and just really, really funny. Really funny. Because it just has the type of, like, literal humor and... You know, random humor, but the good type of random humor. The random humor that's just so random and makes you chuckle. It's also clever. That's the one I kind of want to watch. Seems the most worth it. Man, Daisy Chains are doing a great job <laughs> at stalling, but they just, oh, they're doing a bad job at home at, at killing these guys. Ooh, this is not looking good at all. Not looking good. I think I accidentally placed out a sun to the logo. This is only 25 sun. It's not that much of a waste. Oh, that's frustrating. I, I gotta retire. It's not gonna work. That's... Alright, whatever. I've changed the plans. I'm going to Pyramid of Doom. <sighs> Maybe I'll just have fun with the aqua, or uh, not aqua, aqua vine or hydro vine. I think it's aqua vine if I'm correct. Maybe I'll have a little fun with that and just end it there. You know what? I was going to apologize about sucking at the game, but I, you know what? I don't apologize because at the end of the day, it's just for fun. It's not trying to be the best of the best. It's just about having fun. That's the attitude you should have. Shouldn't let people that bug you for trying to have the best strategy get to you. It's about having fun at the end of the day. And honestly, if you think otherwise, I, I just can't respect that. Because that, that's what video games are for. For fun, you know. Not to be competitive, to have fun. If you, if you get enjoyment out of the competitive, that's fine. But it's about fun, first and foremost. It, it really is. It really is. So I hope you enjoy this, despite me losing a lot. I don't apologize for losing at this point, but if you, you know, if you enjoy it anyways, then I'm very glad and thankful, too. I'm glad you have the attitude. Uh, I mean, obviously, if you can have other criticisms, you know, otherwise, and I'll understand completely, but... That's the criticism you have for me being bad at the game. Well, I'm sorry, but that's not what video games are about. Don't get me wrong, I'm really trying to win as well. Like, I'm trying to see if I can work this out, even if it's hard, but... You know, can't sometimes you just can't be the best in the game. And that's just the way it is, you know? That's okay. You don't have to be the best of the game to be a worthy person. I shouldn't have to say that, but unfortunately... Some people have that mentality. Whew. Yeah, pro this, this is probably going to go on for a long time. So I'm probably going to end it at maybe like when I get to the second flag. But the fact that this is already working is very fun. It's an, it's an easier level, I would say. Not the most toughest zombies. Really not the most tough zombies at all, but... At least it's satisfying, you know. Aquavine is awesome. Really, really good plant. Really good plant. You might even say it's, it's overpowered, but it's a very satisfying. Let me turn the sound effects down. But it's a very satisfying plant. Very enjoyable to use. Ah, oh, man. Ah. Uh, there was a guy at Walmart with just a ton of milk. Just a absolute metric. Fudge ton of milk. I don't feel like cursing. Oh, I erased that shrinking violet way too early. Oh, I feel like I'm gonna be it for that. That no, that's actually fun. I'm still winning. I'm winning. I'm winning. It doesn't matter. I'm winning. I don't even need the shrinking violet, but yeah, whatever. There was just a guy with a ton of milks, and then he wanted a refund. Like, why did you buy all those milks in the first place? What a waste. What a waste of perfectly good milk. That's... Now that's... Oh, that really gets my goat. 
Something about wasting, I just don't like it at all. That much milk. Ugh, oh, you bought all that milk just to make it go bad. They, even, they don't even think of all the other people that might have wanted that milk. The poor cows that made that milk at the factory farms. Shame on you, man. For wasting all that good, precious milk. Oof. Oof. The really makes me... Really gets my goat. Really gets my mother freaking goat. Oof. Those guys, they don't even care. They're just like... Why do they even get all that milk at once? Like, what are you doing that for, man? Like, they don't even seem, like, happy about it. They just seem, like, genuinely frustrated. Like, they wanted a refund for it, for whatever reason. If you're gonna get that much milk, at least commit to it and get it home safely. Even though it's probably most of it's gonna spoil, because milk is very perishable. Especially in the heat of the summer. Probably wouldn't even make it to the car ride to wherever you're going. I mean, Walmart... The one I'm working at really isn't close to any residential area. It's just very, very questionable behavior. I don't know why someone would do something like that. It's very upsetting. To waste that perfectly good milk. Bah, humbug. Bah, humbug. Me being a grumpy old person. That's fine. Sometimes you gotta be grumpy. Yeah, that's why I said I'd end the video the second wave. I'm sure you get the gist. The whole rest of the level is going to be the same anyway. Thank you for watching. Good night, everyone. Peace the frick out. Have a great day or night, as always. Peace.